Ben Heather from the Sprawl, and I'm joined now by the main event winner, Sean Carter. Hey guys, how you doing? How does it feel to uh, to pick up the win tonight, and and uh, especially in front of the home crowd? Uh, yeah, it feels good. Always feels good to get a win. Obviously, um, I sort of been plagued by pullouts a little bit um, for for like last fight and this fight, and sort of so. Uh, a, it was nice to get an opponent, so thanks to my opponent for stepping up short notice and stuff, and also making weight, you know, it was he made bang on 70, so that was good, you know. There was a few other options, but again, it was, uh, you know, like people going, oh, can we do 175 and stuff like that, and I was, I was already fucking like 160 by the beginning of the week, you know what I mean? So, um, so I apologise, like... <laughs> It, in, uh, I honestly thought he was going to come out and fucking swing for the fences and we were just going to like do a bit of fucking like this like when you came sparring that time <laughs> I thought it was going to be a bit like that but you know he it, 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 uh, it went for the takedown I thought the guillotine was there I used it as a sweep and then you know I, I don't know he, I feel like maybe he thought he could get out the back door or, or something but he he, uh, you know, I managed to take the back and I got the choke, you know, so it's um, is what it is, you know, so, um, yeah, so thanks for everyone who came, thanks for everyone that showed me a bit of support, thanks to my sponsors, Mr Chippy, I got free fish and chips, free fish and chips, check that out, and these guys, much appreciated to all of them, thanks for you guys coming, yeah, hum on my balls, bro, let's go. <laughs> And what would you say is uh, next for you, 2017, looking ahead? Christmas. It's <laughs> good Christ stuff. Yeah. You know, Christmas uh, 2017, obviously, you know, um, you know, I had a little bit of a bad, bad streak and I had, you know, um, as, you, as you pointed out in your fucking interview, prick. Right. So, like, Sean, you were really good, now you're a shit house. Give me an interview. I was like, what a wanker. All right. <laughs> I'm but then, he, uh, yeah, so... Uh, so yeah, uh, you know, back to winning ways. You know, I uh, hope hopefully continue that through. Shuffling <laughs> Timbo, Ho hopefully continue that into 2017. Pick up some more wins, and you know, at, at least get back to where I was. If not, you know, much, much, much further and better things. Hopefully. And would, would you say that the, the streak that you had been on almost added pressure going into fights, or, or was uh, it just wanting so much to get the win again? Do you know what? It, like. It's, all, it's always one of them where you, you start off going, ah, oh, I don't want to make excuses, but, and then all that actually comes out of your mouth is excuses, yeah. you know. And I, I do my very best, you know. There's only two guys in there and one guy wins and one guy loses. And, you know, you can always say, fucking hell, you know, I stubbed my toe and I fucking forgot my dinner ticket. But, you know, if you ain't done, you know... If you get a detention, you get a detention, you know what I mean? So, I fucking, uh, like, the one on the Ultimate Fighter, fucking, some people said I deserved the fucking second round, some people that were there were like, oh, I thought you won it, you know, like, that type of jive. You know, I could list a fucking bucket of excuses, but I won't, you know. I lost them fights and I lost them, you know, and that's... That's what it is on Sherdog, and that's what people see. No one comes up and goes, "Oh, what actually happened in this one? How did that one play out?" You know, it's, you know, and with this one, it was, it will show rear naked choke under a minute or whatever, and, you know, hopefully that is, the, uh, the way, the way shit's going down from now on. And I know in the past you've given me a lot of the motivational speeches that I uh, live my life by. I was just wondering if you've got a uh, one that you've been keeping specially for this moment. Yeah, don't get bummed, and if you're a geezer, don't get fingered. That's always that's always a winner. It's a good way to live life. Yeah, I know you get fingered. <laughs> Someone's getting fingered, and it ain't gonna be me. I'm out of here. <laughs>